I am not Morgan Freeman, and what you see is not real. Well, at least in contemporary terms, it is not. What if I were to tell you that I am not even a human being? Would you believe me? What is your perception of reality? I feel really blessed because I genuinely love the process of manipulating people online for money. In an era where seeing is believing no longer holds true. The threat of deepfakes has become increasingly prevalent. The recent incident involving a convincingly real deepfake video of popular actress Rashmika Mandana has not only shocked viewers, but also stirred the Bollywood industry and the government to take action against this growing menace. There is no single way that can guarantee 100% safety from your media being used by deepfake tools, but there are certain steps one can take to decrease that probability. First things first, let's quickly define what deep fakes are. Deep fakes are highly convincing. AI generated videos or images that can make it appear as though someone is saying or doing something they never did. These can be used maliciously to spread misinformation or even damage personal and professional reputations. Deep fakes have been around for some time, but the technology has significantly improved over the years. Um, the advent of AI and AI tools, especially in the last year, has led to the creation of extremely convincing deep fakes. Furthermore, the ease of access to numerous online tools that can generate deep fakes in a few clicks without the need for high tech devices or substantial investment has exacerbated the issue. There are a few things you can do to protect your images and videos from deep fakes. Uh, be careful what you share online. Don't share personal images or videos on social media or other public platforms. If you must share them, make sure you set your privacy settings to the highest level. Tools that create deep fakes require a lot of raw data to train on. By ensuring that your images or videos are private, you can make it tough for the tool to develop deep fakes. Use strong passwords. Use strong passwords for all of your online accounts. This will make it more difficult for hackers to access your images and videos. This is a reputable antivirus program. A good antivirus program can help protect your computer from malware that could be used to leak data from your device. Be aware of the signs of deep fakes. If you see a video or image that seems too good to be true, it may be a deep fake. Be careful about sharing it or believing it. Watermarking, watermarking your images and videos can deter potential misuse. While it's not foolproof, it adds an extra layer of protection, making it harder for others to claim your work as their own. Metadata. Metadata is information embedded in a file uh, that can include details about the copyright owner, date of creation, and location. Ensuring your metadata is accurate and up-to-date can help prove ownership in situations of conflict Besides protecting your images and videos from being used for deep fakes um, as a consumer of media, there are a few tips and tricks to spot fake videos. Here are a few of them to help you decipher what's real and what's not. Look for inconsistencies in the recent deep fake video of Rashmika Mandana. Uh, the AI failed to detect the face in the initial frames, resulting in a noticeable transition to the actress's face. Any unusual action or sound can often Give away a fake video, check for color and lighting mismatches. Uh, if the face doesn't match the surroundings or appears slightly off, it could be a sign of a deep fake. Pay attention to audio quality and lip sync. Any slight mismatch in audio or lip sync could indicate an anomaly in the video. Thanks for watching the video. If it is informative for you, like share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will be back with another video soon. Till then, have fun and happy learning.